So, you know, Seacom, we work with all sorts of different organizations from different verticals, different shapes and sizes, everything from large enterprise through to small businesses. But we also work with a lot of public sector, both local authorities, NHS, uh, you know, the blue lights and uh, a lot of my uh, relationships in those organisations, when we talk about zero trust, uh, I, I'm, I'm seeing this this theme, this perception that, you know, zero trust is just for these large enterprise organisations. You know, the, the public sector aren't ready to adopt this type of technology. And, you know, again, probably going back to that perception of expense. But, uh, you know, what, what, what would you like to sort of share with those guys uh, that might be listening today, Daniel? Yeah. So, so it, it's the perception it's too expensive and and it's just a public sector thing that they should adopt again i, I no i absolutely don't agree with, with that and you know the, the reason for that is is it's a framework it's a concept that you need to adopt to improve your security posture and and it, there's a load of different ways that you can you can achieve this and and i think back to working in the public sector a couple of years ago where you know a lot of them weren't adopting cloud based applications and a lot of them that you, I'd speak to is, we don't adopt cloud and we'd never adopt cloud. Now look at us, we're all working remote and we're adopting cloud applications because now you know the, the results of COVID has really accelerated this new way of thinking and companies are now adopting this new way of thinking. So again, I'm not saying that you need to adopt cloud to adopt zero trust, but we're looking at it from a public sector where they were a lot more slow to adopt cloud-based applications and, and the way of cloud. So there might be the same concept of thinking, hey, we don't need to adopt zero trust yet. And, and maybe that perception is isn't there so much. But no, I, I don't agree. I think it's something that everyone should be adopting and, and looking at their their risk profile. 